Hey, I'm here at Malibu, and uh, behind me is the Virginia Reel going on as a part of the festivities at ninth grade camp. That's right, ninth grade camp at Malibu. Now, for Western Washington, we send most of our ninth graders down to Washington Family Ranch, but Oregon and Southwest Washington is here, as well as about three areas from Western Washington. And uh, serving as a speaker this week, I have just been impressed again with the importance and the uh, the fit of ninth grade camp. Uh, on a, you, you would not believe the freedom that these ninth graders are living in this week. Uh, they really are living life to the full. It has been the most energetic camp we have had by far, and appropriately energetic. It is so much fun. Our clubs, meals, events have all been a great time, and the weather hasn't even been that great. But they're going for it. And I, I just want to remind us, as you are thinking about doing camp allocation and planning for your areas for camping in 2015, please consider ninth grade camp. A couple things. First, our areas that take the most kids to camp every summer use ninth grade camp. So if you want to take more kids to camp, use ninth grade camp. And it's just not the duplication. They take more kids per grade. So it's a fantastic deal. And then secondly, it's just a fit we are able to design something that fits where ninth graders are at. Ninth graders don't deal as much in abstract thought. They're more concrete thinkers still. Even going into the 10th grade, they're still there. So I've had to change almost all my talks. And I've changed illustrations. And even last night, Brenda and I and the camp manager decided to drop a joke because we didn't think it was appropriate for ninth graders. It's perfectly fine for older kids, but not for ninth graders. Anyway, I'm a big believer in it. I hope you're using ninth grade camp. As you're preparing for 2015, think about how you're going to appropriately reach kids with the gospel in a language that they can understand and in an audience that they can feel safe and really live life to the full. Okay, now it stands for the ages, so I'm on. I'm going to go cut it up.